I was uh, in process of helping uh, some foster kids. At the beginning, I was afraid to say hello. I didn't want to speak. I have to help my kids to school, so the only way I can help them is learning. There's no, there's no age limit of learning. I mean, people might think that, but it's really not. Came into the library one day for another meeting, and uh, you know, just saw all these adults in the cubicles, and they were learning to read. They were learning math. That was it. That was the the, the perfect thing to uh, get involved in. What I'm doing is I'm just basically helping them improve their writing communication skills. Throughout the years, I've taught people how to read, and I think it is one of those skill sets that is absolutely essential to have a quality of life. I had to take a test and of course not being able to read very well it's very hard for me to take tests so I panicked and called the library and asked them if there was a college student or a high school student that could help me with reading and I'd pay for it and they told me that there were free services and I didn't have to pay anything if you want to learn something, go in there. I, there was this one woman who came in. She couldn't tell what was junk mail and what was like legitimate things she needed to pay. So uh, it was worrying to her. I actually, I thought that was so interesting. One of my learners came in because of a traumatic brain injury. And uh, she's now attending college. But she didn't feel confident going back at a college level after her accident and so she came to us for encouragement and for help with her memory. You know, it's the uh, inspiration of seeing somebody who is so dedicated to come in every week and better themselves. I improve my self-esteem, my writing, reading, and communication skills here at the library. And I don't need my daughter's translation to the teachers. <laughs> I don't like that. I have met so many wonderful people. My learner is named Nathan, and Nathan had never finished a book. And one of the areas he was interested in was the human body. I always been in the hospital, so I'm always curious that how things work in the body. So we found a book on the human body, and it had a lot of words that probably most people have never seen before because the, the anatomy is all new words. Some of the physiology is very new words. But Nathan is such a go-getter, it didn't slow him down a bit. So we read through this book on the human body, and he finished it. It's fun to watch them just blossom. I felt like I completed something on my own. I got a little help, but most of it is me. Could you or someone you know benefit from our services? Call 760-839-5440 for more information. Are you interested in becoming a tutor? Call 760-839-5440. Four zero for more information.